see? This does two things. One, you're telling her you like her without actually telling her you like her. So your fear of rejection should be downplayed tenfold. And two, assuming you did your research, and if you're part of the TMFM, you should have done your research, and you figured out that this girl loves coffee or whatever she loves, this message is gonna feel targeted, personalized, and that, girls love that. Matter of fact, huh, told you. Now, if you're a jokester and want to keep it even more light, you can try something like, Yeesh. <laughs> Yo, just keep it moving, buddy. This girl ain't it. But don't feel any type of way. All jokes aside, you need to see texting as one single thing. A catapult. A catapult that's going to get you on a first date. And that, that is how you get her to like you in two seconds. Because other little boys, they're probably beating a lot around the bush, hitting her with a, what you doing? Or, good morning, beautiful. Good night, beautiful. Who, on the other hand, you're no little boy. You're a man. And texts like these are going to let her know that you aren't wasting time. Damn, looking a little bummy. I gotta go change. Woo! Much better. Now, boys, I'm gonna show you how you can get some girls in just two seconds. Let's go. Hey, sorry you walked by. I think you're super attractive. You see what just happened there? That's it. Don't overthink it or try to come up with an intricate way to try to impress her. If you're hitting on a complete stranger, it's gonna be very hard to come up with an interesting convo out of thin air. This one single line, there's two things at the same time. Look, she's either gonna one, stop and linger around. Aw, uh, thank you. This brother was a person, his name would be Karen. <laughs> which is just a great sign that she appreciates the compliment and is open for more. In other words, she's actually open to your compliment and wants to have an interaction with you. Now, number two. Okay, thank you, I gotta go. Hey, no problem, have a nice day. If that's the case, bro, just do that. Tell her to have a nice day and farewell. If anything, she'll take it as a compliment and you'll probably make her day. See, that's awesome because you didn't actually get rejected. And that, that's why you gotta subscribe to this channel, boys. I help men become better in every aspect of your life, including how to talk to women. Which, as you're gonna see in the rest of these videos with these tips, talking to women is easier than you think. That's why you gotta subscribe, boys. What are you doing? Click that button. Now, this one I call the coffee shop move. Let's just say that there's a delicious mamacita standing right over there. There's nobody over there, bro. Bro, really? Come on. Bro, come on. Like, just follow the script for a second. Look, your, your man's married, so I need to act it out for you, but I promise you it works. So, let's just say that thick, juicy mamacita standing right over there. You just don't have the cojones to go talk to her. Easy. As you walk by, give her a little smirk as you go to your seat. Then, I want you to just completely ignore her, throw on some nice, smart glasses, grab your book or whatever you're reading, and then just mind your business. This immediately sends her a subliminal signal that you're interested, but also that you have something good to read and that you're no boy, but a man with intellect. And that's just what good friends do. We've all seen this meme that went viral for a women with Ryan Gosling. And who am I kidding? These aren't even reading frames. Boys, these are jade black blue light blocking glasses that you can wear all day long and they're not prescribed. Instead, they protect you from digital devices like your phone or your computer. That way your eyesight stays protected while also allowing you to sleep at night more so you look even more handsome with the added bonus of structuring your face shape and making you look smarter, boys. These two seconds that it takes you on to put these new jade black prism glasses is all it takes to impress a girl. And I know, I know, our prisms are so popular that they're always sold out, I get it. We have a massive shipment coming this June 20th, finally restocking our Prism collection, our entire previous collection, which are our best sellers, plus bringing out new designs like these Prism Aviators, which are just so sick. Like, what other dude are you gonna see in the street with something like this? Nobody. On top of that, we're actually bringing out prescription glasses. That's right, boys. We're gonna prescribe your glasses for only 75 bucks. $75, Italian handmade acetate, free shipping, and prescribed ship to your door. 
boys, you don't want to miss this collection. You don't. And as you know, RJ Black sells super, super fast because they're crazy affordable. Our regular line that isn't prescribed will still be under 50 bucks. And I want you to remind yourself, put a reminder on your phone that on June 20th, 10 a.m. Eastern, we're dropping our new collection. Now, boys, let's keep this going. Keep control of your movements. You see, you can't seem frazzled or anxious when you first try to talk to a girl and impress her because her fight or flight will kick in and that girl's going to fly out of there. Hi. 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 Uh, uh, my, 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 my name's Jose. Lost, <laughs> so to completely neutralize that type of response, I'm going to need you to synchronize your movement. What does that mean? I want you to make sure that your voice, your tone, and your body language are all saying and sending the same message. That consistency, it gives off credibility and trust. Mix signals, just makes you look like a creep. Number five, sliding into TMs. I would just like to say that your boy's like the, like the MVP of sliding into DMs. Like, you know what I mean? Like, come on. Like, you know. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't want to toot my own horn or anything, but like two years ago, you know, I was just minding my own business on Instagram and boom, I see it for the first time. The most perfect girl, what I would like to call a, a triple S. She was sexy, smart, and Spanish, which is a check, check, check for me. Wait, you are tooting your own horn. Really? Bro, I'm gonna have to hire a new cameraman, geez. But here's the interesting part that you need to know. Like me, this girl had tons of dudes in her DMs, right? A lot of guys wanted her attention. Regular Joe Schmoes, celebs, guys, the whole nine. And then it was, there was your man, Jose. That's why you should trust me, bro. But enough tooting my own horn. The point was, I slid into, my, into her DMs. We started talking. Uh, she was in Boston. I was in Florida. And I think you know the whole story. I don't think I've ever, ever gone deep into it. But point is, I'm married. We got a kid. I love the girl. She's the love of my life. And I would never look back. But here's how you do it. It's a twofold game. Number one, it's a numbers game when it comes to DMs. If there is not one particular girl that you're after, I want you to reach out to hundreds of them. From my statistics, anywhere from 15 to 30% will respond depending on how good and solid your Instagram feed is. But if for whatever reason it is personal, I still suggest you reach out to hundreds because it keeps your options open and it doesn't keep you dependent on one girl. That's when you end up needy. But if it is, you want that one particular girl like I did, you want to open up with a personal question. Something that's about her that you saw in her profile or maybe a story that she did. Something that's more than just a generic, hey. And if you can make it relatable to something on your profile or that you guys have in common, that personal relatability increases your open and response rate to like 80, 90%. And by the way, this is factual straight out of the Institute of Jose knows what the hell he's talking about. But mainly it's because it shows that you care and girls want to know that you care. Point is boys, if you want to sign into DMs, these two tricks will get it done. That's it. I told you. I needed somewhere to lean on. You only need two seconds to impress a girl. And if this video didn't prove it, I don't know what will boys. I, 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 I just don't. All right? I do hope though it helps you out and if it does don't forget to subscribe and share this video because guess what there are other men out there that have problems with girls you sharing this video god knows you could probably help that dude find the woman of his dreams start a marriage and a whole family and kids and it was all because you subscribed and shared that video subscribe <laughs> that's it for me in this week's video boys see you next time